Charleston Forge, beautifully handcrafted furniture made in the Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina. Each piece exhibits a sense of hand no machine can duplicate. Our skilled artisans combine age-old blacksmithing techniques with new technology and the finest quality materials to create exceptional and distinctive furniture. Charleston Forge. Hello, I'm Susan Barber. And I'm Art Barber. And we're the founders of Charleston Forge. And Charleston Forge is one of those stories that I wish I could tell you is a dream come true. But the honest truth is we never dreamed that it would be what it is today. Back in 1975, Susan and I started with a little retail fireplace shop here in the beautiful Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina. Uh, that fireplace shop was set up to cater to the high-end second home community that's uh, so predominant up here in these, in these beautiful mountains. Out of that little fireplace shop, Charleston Forge evolved starting back in 1984 when we actually, uh, I learned to uh, cut, bend, and uh, weld metal. But one day we came up with this idea to, to, to take what we had learned by cutting and bending and welding uh, fireplace equipment. We actually started making a few pieces of furniture as display pieces for our, for our store. And one of those pieces was a baker's rack. Somebody came in and saw that piece of furniture and they said you ought to take it down to High Point and put it in the furniture market. So we made arrangements to take it down to High Point and uh, by the time we had gotten to High Point, it was right before the market opened and the people who had invited us down there said, I'm sorry, our showroom's already set up. You can't put your furniture in here. Well, here we had gone from trying to be in the retail business to try to be a manufacturer and got ourselves deeply in debt. So uh, uh, out of an act of desperation, when that showroom was not available, we just took our furniture and set it up out in the hall. That first market, we wrote only 15 orders and one landed a Charleston Forge Baker's Rack on the inside front cover of Spiegel Mail Order Catalog. Now, Charleston Forge has multiple production facilities, a 25,000 square foot showroom in High Point, and a large and diverse client base throughout the United States and the world. Our distinct product line ranges from traditional to transitional to contemporary, with hundreds of choices of frames that are limited only by your imagination. Our products include bar stools, both swivel and non-swivel, dining chairs, both metal and wood, and baker's racks with wood, glass, and slate shelves. Our extensive line of dining, pub, and occasional tables come with glass or solid wood tops, and even concrete. We also have a variety of bed frames in all sizes that will suit any decor. Our steel comes in 10 to 20 foot lengths. Our team inspects each shipment to ensure it passes our stringent quality control standards. For efficiency, we cut multiple pieces simultaneously to keep a steady level of parts for forging and welding. Once cut, pieces are inspected, then shelved to await production. The cut to length steel is heated to about 2,000 degrees during the forging process. Some pieces are heated and hammered as many as five times. Each blacksmith is an experienced artisan. Using pneumatic hammers, they control the speed as well as the location of each strike. Then, to complete the piece, they strike the steel by hand with a hammer. Not all pieces are forged. Some components are bent into shape without heat and some go directly to be welded. The furniture begins to take shape by placing steel components in a fixture called a jig which secures the parts for welding accuracy. During the process to ensure each piece meets our high standards for quality, dimensional tolerance is continuously checked as well as making sure the metal is melting together equally. Component parts, such as leg braces, are sometimes welded by a robot. After welding, some products require grinding and sanding to create a smooth finish. On some pieces, we use a brazing process to add decorative wraps. The furniture then undergoes another inspection. Each weld is checked for strength, and each product is checked to make sure it is level. After inspection, we remove, by hand, weld beads or rough drops of metal that have splattered during the welding process. Then 
Pieces receiving translucent and smooth finishes go through the shop blast machine. Much like sandblasting, this process uses small metal pellets to remove the first layers of loose metal scale. A wire brush is used to clean pieces that get a textured finish, as well as items not able to go through the shot blast machine, such as products made from certain steel tubing. From there, our pieces undergo a five-stage washing process to remove oil and any debris that may be on the metal. Over the next hour, each product is washed twice, rinsed twice, and a sealer is applied. As the product comes out of the washer, it is inspected again for any missed weld beads and dents or scars in the steel. It is sprayed with compressed air to begin the drying process. At this point, only gloved hands touch the furniture to protect it from natural oils. The oil would prevent the powder coat finish from adhering to the metal. Operators use air guns to spray a fine powder coating on the furniture. Pieces are baked in a large oven where temperatures reach up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, liquefying the powder and bonding it to the steel. When the coating cools and hardens, each piece is removed from the conveyor and is inspected again. We also offer hand-painted metal finishes. Each piece is painted individually and takes from four to ten steps to complete. It's then inspected for paint coverage and consistency. We offer a variety of finishes and constructions of wood such as our breadboard constructions that are assembled by hand before being sanded. To achieve the greatest accuracy, we use a computerized router to cut and shape wood for tops and shelves. Then, various sanding machines are used to draw out the wood's natural beauty and achieve a smooth finish. Once sanded, some pieces are distressed by hand, then sanded a final time before going to the finishing process. Each piece is finished individually and takes multiple steps. From the finishing room, pieces are moved to dry. Once dry, each piece is inspected using a color sample as a guide. Everything comes together in final assembly, where attachments are added, such as tops and shelves, cushions, brass finials, bolts, and glass bumpers. The furniture then undergoes a final, formal inspection. Our furniture is carefully placed in packaging designed to best protect it during shipping. Once boxed, the product is moved to the warehouse until the order is complete and loaded on a truck for delivery. Our ability to offer custom products is just one of the benefits that sets Charleston Forge apart from other manufacturers. Anything that we build standard in our jigs, we can make bigger, smaller, add shells to. Uh, we make beds, customized baker's racks, wall shells tables, dining tables, uh, and uh, sometimes a customer will send in a drawing or something, we can build that too. Charleston Forge is founded on a strong family commitment to make beautiful handcrafted furniture. We consider each one of our employees and even our customers to be part of our extended family. We take a lot of pride in the products we produce and in the, the value and the quality that we, that we have in our, in our products. Charleston Forge, a sense of family, a sense of hand.